Hey, how you doing? Listen to this. I've got a great tip for you if you're chipping the ball poorly. I just walked off the golf course with a friend of mine. Every time they had a chip shot today, they used a sand wedge. It didn't matter if they had a short chip shot or if they had a long chip shot. Every single time they chipped the ball today, they chipped it with a sand wedge. Let me tell you what the problem was. Watch this. If you use a lofted golf club to chip a golf ball with, you might be okay on the smaller chip shots, the short ones, where you don't have to make too big of a golf swing. But to make a golf ball go further when you're chipping, you have to make a bigger golf swing. I'll do it face on for you. If I had a small chip shot, the backswing would look something like that, maybe a foot or foot and a half long. If I had a longer chip shot, I would have to make a longer backswing. You have to be so talented to do that. Let me show you something that will really help you. If you have a short chip shot, why don't you try chipping with a 9 iron? Ball in the middle of your stance, a little weight on your left leg, the handle over towards your left leg, and make an arm swing out of it. If you have a medium length chip shot, watch this. The very same golf swing, ball in the middle of your stance, weight over to your left leg with the handle over on your left leg, and make another little arm swing. Because the loft is flatter, the golf ball will go further. I'll take it a step further for you. Watch this. Let's say you had a chip shot and you had to go all the way to the back of the green. Instead of making this long golf swing with a sand wedge, why not try a 5 iron? Ball in the middle of your stance, a little weight on your left leg, handle over towards your left leg, and make the same golf swing that you made with a 9 iron and the same golf swing you made with a 7 iron. I guarantee you this will help you. I'll do it face on. This is the length of a swing that you would want to use to chipping the golf ball to the back of the green using the 5 iron. I guarantee you this is all you need. Get a picture of what you're trying to do. You're trying to make the golf ball go a short distance in the air and a long distance on the ground for a long chip. A short distance in the air and a medium length distance on the ground for a medium chip. Short chip short distance in the air and a little bit on the ground. To do that, try to change the golf club. Control the distance you want the chip shots to go by your club selection, not by the length of your backswing. Try that and have a great day.